Yo, what up? Gonna do a Q&A with Dalia inside of this beautiful Airbnb. So I'm gonna turn this around. It's a pretty dope setup. How you feeling, Dalia? Good. Cheers. We got some wine. Are, are you comfortable? Is this, is this cool? You're in your flippy floppies? Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm having such an amazing trip. Um, we're here for work, although it looks like we're having a lot of fun, which we are, but it's mainly for work, which is amazing, right? That mm -hmm. we can do this for work. So, Drew, we did a Q&A. You did a question box um, on your stories, and we actually got quite a few questions. Look at you being popular. All right. So, what are what are some of the questions? Okay. How did you guys meet? You you tell the story. Uh, we met in New York, 2012, July 29, 2012. Uh, we were across the street neighbors in the Financial Wall Street District. area. Yeah, Financial District of, of New York. Um, so we're coming up on our 10 year since we've met uh, this upcoming summer. So a, a, real, a real New York love story. Do you miss New York City? Do you miss me? Uh, yes, I, love, I miss New York. I miss New York a lot, a lot. And I miss all my friends. Yes, I do miss all my friends from New York. <laughs> what year did you start your business? What was your year start your business? 2016? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I got my real estate license in 2016. We got our first flip deal in 2016. Mm -hmm. um, geez, seems like so long ago, but at the same time, not really. In, uh, in March 2016, we, we, moved, we moved to California. Uh, to California and we bought our first property in August of 2016. And I got my real estate license November of 2016. Nice. Mm -hmm. Favorite restaurant in LA? Ooh, that's a really hard one. I have so many favorite restaurants. I would say Gelada for Thai food. That one's a really good one. That's good. Mm -hmm. Actually, some of the spiciest stuff that we had I there. Know. Last time we were there, I had to walk out of the restaurant. It was a little too hot. Um, I would say just consistently, we've been like five or six times. Uh, it was Jelena in Santa Monica, oh, Venice yeah, area. It's really good. Beats I don't know how to pronounce it, like Jolina or Gajolina. Gajolina, Jolina, yeah, uh, but it's but really good at Venice Beach, right? What's your five-year plan? Ooh, that's a heavy one. Yeah, I mean, gosh, I feel like we moved here six years ago and we've grown so much, so I just can't even imagine what the next five years will be like. Um, I just want to keep doing what we're doing and, and see where that takes us. What about you? I think five years, uh, God willing, we'll have a family. Yes. Uh, continue to grow our business. Um, you know, I think the, the famous Kanye line of do dope shit with dope people. And that's really what's what I want to do. Just keep leveling up, stay humble, and create more experiences with you. And Toro will have some siblings hopefully soon. <laughs> okay. But, uh, yeah. yeah, that's, that's kind great. of the, the plan. What's your favorite thing about each other? I will say that my favorite thing about you is how kind you are, how generous and kind you are to people. You really are. You, you're always very giving and just like, try. you always try to see the best in everyone. Mm -hmm. I appreciate that. Well, besides, you know, you're amazing and beautiful and have an amazing smile. I would actually say that my favorite thing about you is uh, you're you're like a true go-getter, um, a hustler. Like you're you're about your business, and it's inspiring to to work with you as my business partner. Um, and that's my favorite thing, you know, just like you know the ups and downs of of this life in real estate. But I wouldn't want to do it with anyone else. Oh, thank you. That's really nice. Can you adopt me? If I can write it off my taxes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, <laughs> I don't know who wrote that, but. Why not? Uh, I, I forgot to write the names. Drew, how'd you learn Spanish? I learned Spanish originally because uh, we first went to your parents' house when we moved from New York. We stayed at your parents' spare bedroom and, uh, you know, to, to speak with, you know, my suegra had to learn Spanish. But also the trick was in my first Ford Ranger, my yellow Ford Ranger for those that, that remember, um, I had all five presets to like Mexican radio stations. So I love actually a lot of banda. Listen to banda and Norteños. And yeah, that's how you learned. Corridos, and that's how I learned Spanish. Well, you also listen to the Spanish radio too. Yeah, Spanish. I, I oh yeah, that all, really all helped five you. stations. Like were... La Bronca, and oh. I don't even know the other ones, but you would. Uno cero uno punto nueve. 
La Raza, La Raza. Uh, yeah, something like that. Who's winning the NBA title this year? Who asked that for our, our Q&A? I'm not sure. <laughs> uh, honestly, I like uh, the Warriors winning it all. I think they're their favorite too. Oh. Um, but I think Golden State is going to take it all. I, I would say prediction, Golden State versus 76ers, and Golden State wins in, in uh, five games. Okay. Can I stay at your cabin? Yes, anyone will be able to stay at our cabin. I'm excited to share with all our family and friends. Uh, look at this beautiful cabin we're in right now. This is exactly the vibes we're trying to create. Uh, well, similar, um, but it's so exciting. It's so beautiful up here. It's peaceful and it's just, uh, I, I just can't wait till, till yeah, we start. Everyone's invited. I think it's just, you know, we're, we're gonna be building really cool stuff. Um, over the past five years, we've done a lot of renovations and now it's just like, building really like purpose filled purpose Full. driven uh products products and uh, that's where you know that's why we're here um market to, research to market research do some cool r d mm -hmm. but yes you're all invited everyone <laughs> okay who's your favorite artist right now i would say i listen to a lot of in spanish um grupo firme and bad bunny um but like fuerza regida <laughs> <laughs> you listen to a lot of that, uh, no, but who's like your favorite artist right now? Yeah, I mean, Fuerza Regida, El Dinero de los Cambios, that's on repeat right now. Um, I like uh, Dominic Fike out of Florida. Oh yeah, he's so good. Uh, I love Dominic Euphoria. Fike. Um, Bacar, and uh, yeah. Why'd you join Singer Realty Group? Um because I just wanted to be around like-minded people uh, with the same energy, um, doing um, cool stuff, just like looking in the direction of the future, where the market of um, realtors is going, how to do you know new innovative stuff, and I think uh, we're doing that. So, yeah. I, I would also say that since joining Singer Realty Group, you like totally transformed. I feel like you're on a different like playing field now, like with mm -hmm. like like-minded peers. Yeah, I, I my old firm. I mean, I was a solo agent, so I was just motivated as I, I mean, am you, now. You just you know. got two open escrows today. I know. It's That's exciting. dope. Hey, congrats. Thanks. That's dope. <laughs> Probably what are questions. you most excited about this year? Um, I would say starting to build our cabin. Um, it's, it's like super exciting. I hope it's. Hopefully ready by winter time. Yeah, I think it's gonna be ready. Uh, the first one we're building is gonna be ready by, I would say like Labor Day weekend, and the second one will be ready. I would say like you know around Christmas. So that's gonna be exciting. But mm -hmm. for me, the most exciting thing that I'm, or the thing that I'm most excited about this year, man, just leveling up. Just you know keeping those folks around me. I feel like I have a really really good group of folks around me right now that's pushing me to to be better in every single way. Um, and just, just level up. I feel that. When are you guys having a baby? <laughs> Soon. Soon. <laughs> it's not as easy as just yeah. boom, boom, boom. <laughs> uh, hopefully by the end of this year. We'll... Yeah. Hopefully, uh, Santa gives us some good news and, um, exactly. Yeah. But hey, God willing. Yeah. Cheers to that. Well. That's it. That's that was it. really fun. Yeah. Do you want to ask me a question? Uh, what's your favorite thing about working with me? I think that when you work with your spouse, there is just a different level of motivation. And I view you as an equal, as a partner, that I can bounce around ideas with you and be really honest. But also, it's kind of like 24-7 nonstop. So, at this, you know, it's a double-edged sword. I'm, my favorite part about it is just because you are my right hand, um, being able to just like, if we win, it's a team effort and uh, just abundance mentality. And I just love doing that because I see our future, you know, compounding 10 X over the next 10 years plus. Um, and just, yeah, that's exciting. I to love me. that. Cheers to that. <laughs> and what do you want to ask me? What is, uh, what is one thing that you've learned about the Indian culture? Oh man, so many things. Well, there's a lot, a lot of um, sacred days where it's like, okay, auspicious days, I should mm, say. Word, auspicious yeah. days. 
on those days, like you should do this or you shouldn't do that on those suspicious days. Um, very family oriented community, um, very tight knit community. Everybody helps each other, and I just love that. Mm -hmm. Actually, the Mexican and Indian culture are, are very similar. Mm -hmm. When I, when I first started dating, it's like, you know, a roti or tortilla. Oh, igual. yeah, a roti and tortilla. Tortilla de harina and roti. Or... <laughs> yeah. Almost the same. But cool. That awesome. was fun. Yeah. Thank you guys for the questions. All right. <laughs> Till next time. Cheers to Cheers. that. Cheers. Show this beautiful view. Let me, it, let so me nice. show this beautiful view before we tune out. We're here for the next couple of days. But Drew and Talia, where are you? Signing out. Peace.